Hello fellow YouTubers, and this is a video on how to salvage parts from a laptop. This is my laptop, it is, well, its motherboard is dead, and I'm going to be taking the parts out of it. All you're really going to need for this is a set of small screwdrivers. This one and this one will be coming in useful. And you want to make sure you're statically discharged. So it's going to take a screwdriver and unscrew Now I'm just going to pull this little tab and undo it slowly. And there we are. You can see all the main components here, hard drive, Wi-Fi card, RAM, heatsink, and underneath here, the CPU. We've also got the DVD drive here. You can see that that will be under there. So once you're inside, you can start undoing some of these screws. So I want to take out the hard drive. I can see from here that there are two screws here holding it in. Some won't even have screws, some might. So if I... I'll take out the RAM next. You can see it bends quite freely. There are two tabs. I don't know if you can see that there. On each side there's a little tab. Pull that back, which should pop out, which means you can then just take it out. Uh, next easiest thing would be the Wi-Fi card. These, well, I don't know if it's going to be the same to be honest, but these little wires attached to it, you can pull them off quite easily, just being careful. And just to show you, there are two screws there that I also need to take off. It pops out, and I can just take that out there. It's the Wi-Fi card slotted in there. Um, DVD drive. Now, I know the DVD drive is there. And there's no obvious way to get to that. I can just see it there. And if I push on it, nothing happens. But what I have got is a screw there and I think that's holding it in so I'm just going to undo that and I'm going to try again yep that's it DVD drives out okay and you see that we've got several screws on there, on there, on there, on there and then the three actually on the CPU most of them have four, this one seems to have three. I'm just going to undo all these screws. Now we are on the main CPU screws. Now this is a bit more complicated. You'll see that they're numbered most of the time. We've got one, two, and three. Do pay attention to the numbers. On this laptop, these screws don't actually come out all the way. They're held in a bit, but... Yeah, so unscrew them, so you don't just do one all the way and then another all the way because then you're putting pressure from one side of the CPU. You don't want that. And we gradually undo them all so the weight's evenly distributed. There we are. This will slide out of there. And that's the heatsink off. Now, we've got the actual CPU here. This is where this screwdriver comes in. It's flat. A lot of laptop sockets are like this. You put the screwdriver in there, and then you turn it, and then it'll slide, allowing you to take the CPU out. So I'm just going to do that now. Try and get a better angle. I'm just going to undo it. You see how that slid there? This should, yep, it's out. Now, my CPU has pins on it, as you can see. Don't ever touch any of the pins. If one of your pins is broken, your computer won't work. 